Hey, how's it going? It's Aiden from The Noise Club and I'm very, very, very excited today because I, you probably know this from the title of the video, have an iPad. And here she is. I've not opened it yet because I was waiting for, to uh, record. We've even got an Apple Pencil. Look, 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 can you, can you see it? Yep, yep. I've been wanting one of these for a long time and so the, the main reason is to do art, like obviously, because it's, you know, drawing. I've always wanted a tablet, but I didn't want to sort of spend a lot of money on a on a tablet with a screen, a drawing tablet I mean, but also what's put me off of buying an iPad for a long time is the, the cost. And this is the brand new 2021 9th gen iPad, the one that's like 320 pounds. And I was like, that's amazing. For the price, you know, for what you get, obviously the Apple Pencil is like eight quid, which is a bit pricey, but there was no point in buying the iPad without the pencil because I've literally bought it just for the the whole aspect of doing like graphic design stuff. So yeah, I am so, I'm so happy. Shall we unbox it? I think we should unbox it. Should probably try and get a different angle. So uh, yeah. Okay, so this is probably the best angle. Uh, I know you can't see my face, but I'm only working with one camera. So we've got a little box cutter thing here. Um, I, I quite appreciate that they've attached them together like that as like a little bundle thing. Because when they when they came packaged, it just means that you know they weren't. It wasn't going to be sort of too moving about too much and too awkward. Let's open up the Apple Pencil first. Okay, there we go. Got got the got the plastic off. Um, now what do we do? There's a little tab here. Do I just? Oh oh oh! You ready? You ready? Do 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 do. Nice, nice. Cool. Okay. What do we What do we get? Oh, we get a spare nib and a whatever that is. I don't know what that adapter is. It's an adapter of some sort, which I'm sure will come in handy. Um, let's have a look. Do you know, I've never actually. Um, oh, what's happened here? I don't know where the camera was going then. Um, but yeah, I've never actually. Um, held an Apple Pencil before, so, ooh, oh, it's magnetic, so this is, this feels nice, this feels really like a pencil would, I guess, um, which is really, really cool, let's take off this, can we, can we do it in a, in a satisfying way, I don't know if we can, wait, wait, um, no, that, that that was not satisfying. In fact, this is actually really awkwardly packaged, but the oh shit, smooth. I've been told it can be quite slippery, so I might get one of those grips, but this one feels like, it doesn't feel too bad actually in my hand. It's nice, it's, it's, yeah, yeah. Cool, well that's that. Let's, um. Open up the iPad now. Yeet. Okay, let's look at this beauty. This should be easier to open because there's um, some like. Oh, oh, there we go. So then, oh yeah, oh yeah. Should we do a bit of a peel? Is this going to be more satisfying? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Just a little bit, just a little bit more satisfying. Do you know what? The, the, the most satisfying part is coming, I'll tell you. Are you ready? This, any Apple product, uh, if I actually, not, not only just Apple products, but um, Huawei products actually, if my phone sort of, my phone case did this, but this is the most satisfying thing ever. Oh yeah, oh yeah, it's coming, oh yeah. Oh. Oh, that's the stuff. That is the stuff. Hello, gorgeous. Mm. Oh yeah. It's just don't mind me. I'm just, just um. Oh, oh, oh. oh, it just feels really nice as well. I think I've only ever like held one iPad. Um, and that was like a really old, old sort of probably f second generation one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 
Do we just slide it out? Or do we just... Oh. 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 Oh, look at it. It's so shiny. Oh, yeah. Can you see my face in it? That is so nice. Wait, does that... Does the Apple Pencil charge on the side of it? I've heard it does. I don't... Oh, um, well, wait, that must... I think that's a generation two one. Never mind. Is there any power in this? Oh, there is. Okay. Well, while that's turning on, let's have a look what we've got in here. So we've got a charger cable and power brick. Yes, a power brick. That looks interesting. It folds. I don't. Oh, yes, English, please. Thank you. United Kingdom. Um, we got some... We got some stickers. We have, I think. We got stickers. Boy, anything else? Oh, my God. <laughs> it's on 69% battery. 69%. That is, I mean, if, uh, if that was on purpose by someone that works at Apple, props to you, because that's just amazing. Um... <laughs> Oh, it's actually, oh, so it's USB-C to, this plug is cool as fuck. Whoa. I'm more impressed by the plug than I am the actual iPad. That is freaking cool. My mind is blown. <laughs> now that's how you do a travel plug. None of this sliding crap, man. That is good quality. I'm gonna get this all set up because obviously I need to go put all my information and stuff in. And once all that's done, uh, we'll see if we can s record what's on here. Right, that's better, my face is back. So yeah, we're gonna get this set up, get it all um, sorted and set up and then we'll be back. Okay. Okay, cool, I've got it all set up now. Um, as you can see on the screen, I'm actually doing um, I'm capturing this via Elgato's um, screen capture thing. It's like a share thing. It's weird. It's like wireless. Oh wait, that's way better. I I've added like yeah, um, portrait the entire time, but landscapes way better. I've had a little a little browse and a little tinker and and you know there's it's it's basically a giant a giant iPhone. So there's not really much. I guess exciting about it however I have downloaded an app called Procreate and all you digital artists out there I'm sure you've heard of this I'm sure you know what it is I've only just heard of it sort of in recent months so I thought I'd buy it because it's a it seems like a really really good application to make art in and, and graphic design and that's kind of the whole reason why I bought this iPad right however I have no idea what I'm doing with it because I had a little tinker with it so if we do a new project and we do uh, let's just do entire screen size yeah I I'm not gonna lie I don't really know um, what I'm doing too much on this what's look how bright that is so we're just gonna have a mess around see what we can do I am I think I'm gonna take some time over the next couple of days get used to it and get better at it and then try and do a full video on doing some digital art uh, let me know what you think I'd, I'd be really up for that but for now I guess we'll just have a little mess around oh my god you can do a flare so if I just did this ah yeet the only thing oh wait there was an undo button I couldn't find that early I'm like why is it no why is it not oh oh I was like why is there no undo button and it's it's right there so this is really fucking cool because this app is just insane, actually. Wasteland. Should we see if we can do a bit of a landscape? It's probably not gonna go very well. Also, apologies if you can hear my cat in the background. Um, she's in season. <laughs> she's making a horrible, horrible noise. Rust of decay. These all sound really cool. Let's, let's try and do some like urban-esque. This might come out really, really bad. It might come out really good. Like I said, I don't really know much about this. I'm just getting used to. I'm getting used to, just getting used to all the um, stuff that's included. Oh, organic water, rain, forest. Ooh, we can have. Okay, okay. Well, first of all, um, is there a fill tool? Oh, this is cool. We got like different. Pa oh, that's cool. You got different palettes. Where's the fill tool? Is it here? No, that's 
Um, that's really cool. You can time lapse record. So you can like do a time lapse of this. I mean, I'm already, already recording it anyway, so that's, that's fair enough. Oh, color fill. There we go. Am I in a different layer? Right, okay, background layer. Let's get. Oh, okay. Like a grey, almost almost like a grey blue sky. I don't want it to be dark though. Let's do some rainforest. Ooh, oh my god, this is so cool. What? What the heck? This is sick. So I just realized I'm gonna be looking down the entire time, but it's fine. You don't really need to look at my face. You can look at this cool as heck thing. This is insane. Holy shit. Let's just utilize I'm lost for words. <laughs> Let's just think. Oh my god, that's so good. Holy crap. Do you know what? This kind of looks like it's going to be a volcano, so I think we should just go for a volcano. Why not? Um, this kind of looks a bit shit at the bottom now, though. <laughs> but it's fine. It's fine. Let's look at more organic stuff. Mountain ash. That's perfect. So if we bring this onto this layer, I think. Yeah, that's not that great. Maybe if I bring the opacity down, make it a little bit bigger, and just kind of do that. Like I said, I'm still getting used to it. There's nothing on that layer. It is. No, there isn't. Um, I, I, I do want to spend more time with it. Yeah, and try my best to get used to it and make something really, really cool. Because that's kind of where I want to be. Okay, what's this look like? Let's get a bit of a darker colour. Oh, okay. Let's go for a sketch of a volcano then. Do you know what? This is actually look. I, I, I'm liking the way that this is looking. It's going to be very abstract, okay? Don't judge. My goodness. <laughs> My cat. Didn't think this through very well, did I? No, I did not. But yeah, that's good. I mean, it's like a weird purple, but I don't know. I'm kind of digging it. What do you reckon? I mean, we could do some shading and stuff to make it look a little... Um... I mean, that is that is really purple, actually. Oh, yeah. Let's have some of that. It's all right. We're, 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 good. we're getting there. We're getting there. Um, artistic. Leth... Ooh. Old beach. Do you have any, like... Oh, stone wall. Duh. Oh, yeah. Now, this is what I'm talking about. Some actual texturing. You don't even have to do any work. And we've already got kind of a basic shading underneath from whatever the fuck it is I just did. So we just kind of do that. And then we get a tiny bit of a lighter color. Just to give some highlights. Yeah. It's very abstract, but you know what? I'm loving it. I am loving it. Give me these clouds again. Because it's it's going to be a, th a thick boy in the sky, isn't it? It's kind of like, it's kind of like a really good, bad kid's drawing. It's like, it's like it's good. It's so good that it's bad. Or is that just me? Um, hoping that I'm much better than I actually am. <laughs> Probably. Right, mountain ash. Is this gonna give us what we want this time? Oh yeah. That's kinda, kinda what we want, right? It's a little bit too dark there though. We just gotta add a little bit of a uh, texture to it. So just trying to build up the uh, the sort of thickness as it's getting away. Um, and then, yeah, just give it a bit of that. You gotta give it, give it, give, give it, you gotta give it a bit of a slight texturing around the edges. I think this is quite a good little first experiment though. I don't know about you. Although I do wanna make this look, look a little bit more earthy down the bottom rather than actual, um, like, I don't know, like lava. I mean, it looks like lava, but I don't really want it like. Or do we, or do we, do we want it lava? What do we think? 
Ooh, okay. Ooh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that, I like that. Okay. Okay, now, now we're looking a bit more magma -y, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Don't overdo it, though. Can't overdo it. It just looks like fire. <laughs> it's just, it just looks like, it looks like a really shitly made TP that's on fire. TP, I don't know why I said it like that. TP. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> like, fire gets more yellowed towards the top. But if it's magma, meg, magma, um, then it's going to be like a sort of crusty orange, isn't it? I mean, that just looks like fire. This just looks, this looks like a child's cave painting, but it's fine. We, we are, we're doing it. We're doing it. I kind of want to make this volcano look a little bit better though, because it's looking a bit shite at the moment. It's okay, you can say it, we're all thinking it. Or maybe we do zombie skin all over this, all over the actual um, volcano and see what happens. What colour should we go for? Should we go for like a light colour? Oh. Well, I don't think there's much more I can do without... Yeah, I, I mean, I, I didn't really have an idea anyway. I just started drawing and this is kind of what I came up with. But I like it. It's good. It is just so nice just to be able to draw on something like this. And like, I've, I've got a, a, a tablet, a graphics tablet. But like I said, you can't... You can't see what you're drawing. You have to look at the screen, and because you're looking at the screen, you don't know like where you are on the on the surface, and it just makes it incredibly difficult to try and draw precisely or to try and you know do fine detail. And this is just such a godsend. It's such yeah. This is literally the reason why I bought it. Um, well, the main main reason was just purely for the fact of using it for for digital art and hopefully i can get better at procreate uh, i have downloaded photoshop on here as well because i've got photoshop but this just looks way more in depth and versatile and the tools are all are just there at your disposal like with photoshop you know you you have your standard brushes but to be able to get any of these kind of brushes you have to troll the internet or you know or just use the adobe marketplace which i never use anyway uh, it, it, this is just so much easier because everything's just there just to you straight away so it, it's it's so good it's so good and i'm gonna try yeah like i said learn it a bit better try and think of a good idea or if you've got any ideas uh, you want to see me draw in in a separate video um please do let me know and i will happily oblige um but in the meantime i'm gonna try and practice get better i think once i know what i'm drawing it's sort of pretty easy i just need to get used to the actual program but yeah that's the video i'm really really happy uh, i finally got an ipad um something that's you know gonna be really great to draw on it's gonna bring me great joy and i look forward to making some stuff for you guys and for myself and just in general having a bit of a fun bit of a fun just one fun i'm only allowed one fun but thank you for sticking around and i really appreciate it and uh yeah i will see you in the next video please let me know what you want me to draw below uh okay love you take care see you later